Hello students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com. My name is Ramandeep Singh and today we are going to do an important topic for Bank of Maharashtra Journalist Officer 2023 exam. So types of charges over securities. What is a charge over security? Various types, types of mortgages, types of charges. That's what we are going to discuss today. A lot of questions were asked in the previous exams in this particular topic, from this particular topic. Both easy sa topic hai, ek do questions aate hai har bar. So Bank of Maharashtra Journalist Officer 2023 course, it's already available on bankexamstudy.com in which we are covering the entire syllabus with the help of video classes, notes, quizzes and the test series. This is my personal WhatsApp number. In case of any doubt, please ask your questions. So students, what is a loan? I hope you already know that. So loan, um, you need money, right? For example, you need money, you go to a bank. Uh, you may need money for multiple, uh, you know, purposes, you may need money to buy a bike, you may need money to buy a house, you may need educational loans, right? So right now we are going to discuss about secured loans only secured loans, in which you give some security. Okay. So in case of a bike, if you do not pay your EMIs on time, what happens? If you do not pay your EMIs on time, they are going to take away your bike in case, but during the period, during the period of your loan, if, if it is a 36 months loan, you are going to use that bike. You keep on using that bike. It is with you. In case of a house, the same thing, you just pay the EMIs, you fail to pay the EMI, they are going to take away your house, right? A lot of examples are there. What happens in case of shares? shares, you pledge the shares, right? A lot of examples are there. That's what we are going to discuss today. So what is a security when you go to a bank for taking a loan? Let's say you want to take gold loan, you give your gold ornaments, the banks, they're going to evaluate that and on the basis of the valuation, they're going to give you loan. So that is a security, right? In case you refuse to pay on time, they're going to sell off the gold. Okay. So let me just hide myself. So what are the various types of charges? There is mortgage, there is pledge and there is hypo hypothecation. Okay, hypothecation. So the mortgage is generally created on immovable properties. Most of the housing loans are mortgages, right? On uh, land and building mortgage loans are taken, right? Mortgages is there in case of land and building. Who gets the position borrower? has the position. So that's important. Generally on immovable properties and borrowers, they, they have the possessions, right? You take a housing loan, you get the possession. In case of a uh, pledge, pledge in case of pledge, it is generally movable goods or property, for example, share certificate, gold jewelry, gold loan is a very good example, who keeps a position when you take the gold loan, the bank or the Muthoot finance or NBFCs, they take your gold, the lender is having the possession, the lender is having the possession, you get your money, right? So uh, in, in case of pledge, the who gets the possession of security, in case of gold loan, the bank or NBFC, they get the possession of the security. Okay, that is a pledge. Bank is a pledgy. Bank is a pledgy. And you are a pledger or a borrower. Hypothecation. In case of hypothecation, uh, good example is a bike loan. So generally, in case of movable goods or properties, uh, for example, a bike, the borrower has a possession, but uh, the lender has right in case you refuse to pay, they are going to take away your bike. So the uh, fine line or difference between mortgage and hypothecation, uh, the only difference between mortgage and hypothecation it's a kind of property it is. Okay, so these are the differences. The major difference creator is, uh, you know, who has the possession and what kind of property uh, is involved in each type of these charges, right? So please remember that this table very, very important. Okay. What are the types of charges? Uh, there is a fixed charge and there is a floating charge. In case of a fixed charge uh, is a kind of charge created on properties and assets 
the identity nature and ownership of which does not change there is no change in case of a fixed charge there is no change in the charge there is no change in the security while in case of floating charge for example overdraft limit uh, which is based upon inventory which may change over time right the the value of stock may change for example in case of a sari shop the value of inventory that they have may change over the period of time uh, okay so floating charge fixed charge in case of floating charge there may there might be changes right type of mortgages this is a very very important topic asked many times in the previous exams the simple mortgage as the name suggests the borrowers they need to sign an agreement stating that if he or she enables to pay then the lender that he can he or she can sell the property simple mortgage okay that's a simple uh, example simple mortgage nothing complicated then mortgage by conditional sale uh, there can be certain conditions uh, added to a simple mortgage that if you unable to pay, we are going to raise the interest rate. Okay, we are going to raise the interest rate or conditions can be there, right? So under such mortgages, the lender can put a certain number of conditions that in case of uh, delay of payment, uh, there can be, you know, penalty or there can be increased rate of interest so that is mortgage by conditional sale english mortgage this question was asked in the previous papers okay pichle saalo mein aaya so in such uh, cases in this type of mortgage the borrower has to transfer the property in the name of the lender so whoever uh, let's say a is the borrower b is a lender okay a is going to uh, to the b so whatever the property he has so land or whatever he has he needs to a needs to transfer the uh, ownership to the bank so when he repays that when he repays the loan when a or the borrower repays the loan then he'll get back his property that is english mortgage okay then what is fixed rate mortgage when the lender assures a borrower that the rate of interest would remain same throughout the loan period there will be no change in the interest rate or emis or anything that is fixed rate mortgage the name is little funky uh, yusuf uh, fructuary yusuf fructuary mortgage in this kind of mortgage the uh, the lender has a right over the property uh, for the due course of loan period so the lender has a right for example in case of i mean it's not very uh, you know popular in case of formal uh, you know uh, mode of lending but uh, in the um, informal uh, lending what happens is when you give your bike to um, you know in in villages that happens very uh, that's very common you give your bike uh, as a security to a lender uh, i mean until you repay that loan the lender is going to use your bike right that's very common in uh, in villages of punjab right so so that is uh, the kind of loan the lender has a right to use uh, the property he can uh, rent the property right anomalous uh, mortgage i mean combination of different type of mortgages is called anomalous mortgage what is a reverse mortgage it was in the news in 2013 2014 so uh, some you know somebody let's say some elderly people like 60 70 years old 80 years old they have a house let's say they have a house but they do not have uh, money to survive they do not want to sell the house they want to live in that house so what they can do is they can mortgage that house in return of monthly payments they are going to get monthly payments from the lender 40,000 50,000 I mean depending upon the value of house uh, and at the end of that uh, you know uh, period uh, if there is an hire they need to repay the loan to the bank to take back the ownership of the property okay so that is reverse mortgage uh, the elderly people they give their house or generally they give their house to the lender and the lender gives a monthly payment to the borrower and that's how it works 
equitable mortgage. In this type of mortgage, the title deeds of the property are given to the lender. A very common practice, right? Uh, you give your property papers to the lender, right? And then they give you the loan, right? So that's how it they secure the loans, right? So students, that's all very important class, uh, part of Bank of Maharashtra Journalist Office, of course. Um, students, we are covering the entire syllabus with the help of video classes, notes, test series, proper live sessions, quizzes. If there is any doubt in your mind, drop a WhatsApp message 9067201000. That's my personal number. And uh, list of our successful students who cracked the Bank of Maharashtra 2022 this year's exam, all these students who took a course. All these students that took a course in the previous years and they cracked their respective exams. I'm really, really happy for them. If there is any doubt in your mind, ask your doubts and we are going to answer your doubts. Uh, there is a comment section. You can ask your doubts there as well and we are going to answer you. That's all for today's students. Thank you and uh, have a nice day. Bye-bye.